Hey guys, Chad Spire Racing Heads. I want to show you my V Factor 3.00 nitrous version. We'll start with softened chamber. This cylinder head here is going to Steven in New York. Chris Cobb's building the engine. All the parts are going to him, but I uh, give some extra love. You can see I finished the chambers. I um, hand finished the intake ports. I hand finished the exhaust ports. But I just want to show you uh, there we go. 50 degree seats, big throat, six degree taper, valve job right out to the edge, two 150, one 600 valve. Uh, I just want to show you guys, I mean, I, had a, I have another video, <coughs> excuse me, on my website. It's about 10 years old now, but I just want to show you guys, this is a lot more than just a big freaking hole. <coughs> I mean, uh, Cobb's had a couple in builds, uh, one build made 855, 437, one build made 825. So basically I've got customers that will build their own engines, build them in the garage. They will make 800 all day long. Uh, this thing's ran uh, 480 with a fogger at right at 3,100 pounds. Uh, had a 434 on a chassis dyno with a fogger, made 1,040 to the tire. It's ran 920 NA at 3,200. It's ran 560 NA at 3,200. Got these on some Sega uh, old school front axle killer cool cars. They've made 2.18 horsepower every cubic inch. Uh, it's not just a big hole. It works. It, it works. Um, you can see here. Let me give you. Uh, I love I love short sides. There's a short side. Big and wide. See the little bit wing there tipping out. Um, let me get you a close-up picture here. Hand finished. Got the floor vein. It's just for looks. That's all it does. It's nice and pretty. Um, foul job. Forty. It's got a forty-degree top cut. You can see how it just blends right into the chamber. Uh, here's the rockers for it. Um, Five fifty intake. 80 exhaust uh, this particular set here uh, I didn't have any more castings it didn't have any push rod reliefs so we had to have them welded up uh, but it'll be just fine uh, we talk about flow numbers I'll take you over to the bench here in a second and show you how much they flow uh, but again I just want to show you it's it's just not a big hole put a lot of time in it you can see uh, you can see how far out that bulls kicked let me see if I can get you some light in here. Got a buddy that calls it the Kansas Kickout. LOL. You can see how big it is. It's huge. Absolutely huge. Great head. Got about 30 sets out. Like I said, it's a 2150 valve. There you go. There's some hand work. See if I can get you some shots of the, you can see uh, foul job. Got a 91.5% throat, got a 93 exhaust throat. Uh, let me take you over to the bench. Ow. 4155 fixture. It's exactly how I flow it. I put a head bolt, I don't put a sleeve in it. Billet plate. 200 to one inch. It moves some air. Straight up, true, 23 degree. Not a 21, not a 22. Straight up, old school, 23. 23 degree is alive and well. Kicking ass at SRH. I've got a full line. Most of you guys know that. Same casting. 205, 227, 250, 265, getting ready to come out with the 275 port. 
dedicated small bores, 4060 wide, big bores, 4140, 4145 wide. Put a lot of time in them. Dedicated casting, again, I don't know if you can see it. SRH, doesn't have that on it. It didn't come from this shop. Great cylinder head. Profiler does a great job. So if you guys have any questions, I'm always here. Feel free to call 785-623-0963. Thanks to each and every one of you that have bought a set. Appreciate each and every one of you. Take care.